kinetic energy and the work energy theorem according to the kinetic energy and work energy theorem the work done on an object by a net force equals to the change in kinetic energy of the object mathematically we can write this as the work done w is equal to change in kinetic energy or del e here is the proof we know that the work done is equal to the dot product of force multiplied and the distance travel can be written as f dot ds according to newton's second law the force is equal to the mass time acceleration here we put the value of force and the equation become w is equal to m a dot s according to the newton equations of motions we know that 2 a s is equal to v f square minus v i square dividing both side by 2 a the distance s equal to v f square minus v i square divided by 2 a we have put this value of s in the equations and the equation become W is equal to m a dot v f square minus v a square divided by 2 a. Now, the acceleration and acceleration cancel with each other and the equation become 1 over 2 m into v f square minus v i square. Now, multiply 1 over 2 m with v f square minus v i square. When we multiply 1 over 2 m with v f square, it becomes 1 over 2 m v f square minus 1 over 2 m v i square. We know that the kinetic energy is equal to 1 over 2 m v square. Now we simply add the term kinetic energy final minus kinetic energy initial or the change in the kinetic energy where the work done become equal to the change in the kinetic energy.